Hi guys, Irina Bakley here, a licensed relationship therapist from Irina Bakley Counseling LLC.com. And today I wanted to talk about why losing an occasional argument with your partner might actually be helpful for your marriage. So stay tuned. All right, so let's talk about why losing an occasional argument with your partner might be actually helpful and beneficial for your marriage and relationships. So let's think about it. Uh, when we enter a partnership with two or more people, right, it's not all about me and, and or about you anymore. Me and you become us. So we become united and we become one thing. So me wanting to win. So, so actually, let me go back a little bit. So as an individual person who is not part of the couple or not part of the marriage or not part of the partnership, we have this innate desire to be right, right? To be heard, to be understood, to have the last word, to kind of show you my knowledge and my expertise or just that I know more and I'm better a little bit. It, it, it might not be as aggressive or not everything from what I'm saying applies to you in your particular situation. But maybe on a subconscious level, we want uh, to, to, to be right and to tell you exactly how it is, right? And sometimes it's as a result of low self-esteem, sometimes it's a result of our ego, sometimes it's a result of combination of both or other things. And so when we become we, when we become a couple, uh, a family, then this concept actually hurts our the quality and the connection in, in, in the relationship very much because as you know as an individual me winning equals me being happy equals me you know something positive right doing better in one way or another in a in a couple context however me winning does not necessarily benefit their marriage actually on their you know on their on the opposite it a lot of times slowly destroys or very quickly destroys the relationship because it means that I'm winning, but you're wrong, and our relationship and it, uh, you know, suffers as a result. So try to choose to you know, being connected over winning the argument because um, you know, if you are winning the argument but your relationship is suffering as a result, is that really a win? Is that really what you know what something that you really want probably not so how much of a win is that so be really strategic and, and, and understand that it's not as um, simplistic and black and white and that um, there is this kind of emotions versus logic you know paradigm and 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 struggle going so a lot of times you can apply logic and be strategic and, and talk and problem solve about the argument and stuff but it doesn't work that way. It doesn't apply to relationships. And so a lot of times emotions play a huge role. And so you kind of want to be aware of that. And, and, and again, understand that um, what, is, what is the underlying process that happens for you? Why is it that you want to win? Be honest about it. Understand it first. Be aware of it. And then be honest about it. Even talk to your partner about it. Um, and always approaching approaching an argument from a soft, vulnerable place where you share your fears and your sadness with your partner instead of sharing blame and kind of sending bullets to your partner is always, always, always much, much better um, than, you know, than the other scenarios. So I hope this was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my video. If you find it to be beneficial, uh, share it with with other people and we will see you soon. Bye-bye.